Okay, let me think one, let me think one, let me think one, let me think one. Let me think one. Um, my revision tip would probably be, don't leave to the last minute. Don't revise the night before because you won't be able to process all the work and you might stress yourself out a bit too much. you just got to do it. Going over the stuff that you struggle on because the things that you know, you know. <laughs> Start as early as possible so that you can carry on going over it. You only have one chance, so just get it done, be motivated. Don't get distracted by the internet. <laughs> Wait, is it okay? Use revision cards, is that okay? You should isolate yourself within the time that you have. Um, use revision cards. You get to use a revision timetable and manage your planning. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And it's only a short amount of time for your exams and you have a longer summer, so then you can socialise more then instead of socialising while you're going through your exams. Because at the end of the day, then you might not have enough time. Um, I like to write a lot of notes and then read in front of the mirror. Just read them out. <laughs> Use like flashcards and put a load of basic information on one side and then maybe a question regarding that information on the other side and then you can give it to a parent or a brother or sister or a friend and they can quickly test you. Make posters. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Keep on top of all your work and don't get too stressed. Start reviving really early, don't be bored to last minute. Don't procrastinate. That's it. Plan ahead and make sure your goals are achievable. Get revising.co.uk and just ask teachers for help. <laughs> I don't revise. No. Study, study leave, study leave. Yeah. Uh, use your study leave very wisely um, and have sleepless nights. Uh, cause I'd, uh, make a revision timetable. I do, I do. Um, I probably pass papers and do them over and over again because you'll still get them wrong but then you'll do them right eventually. Use flashcards. Organise all your notes into ribbon cards that are clear and easy to understand. Mind maps with lots of colour, like my shirt. The internet is your friend, and if you Google your subject and revision help, please, it will give you lists and lists for all of my revision I just typed in. Revision for this, and then you get past papers. Past papers are good. Um, quizzes online, um, ex students who've done YouTube clips and websites, stuff like that, please all them. Get a timetable plan. Okay. I think, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm done. Uh, use your phone, there's loads of apps out there to help you study and stuff. Yeah, and you can use some of that as well. Don't panic. Keep your mobile phone out of reach. Just because you got good grades at GCSE doesn't mean you will at A level. Oh, um, yeah, just study flat and not just study one. Um, just do some. Yeah. Make a revision timetable. You just gotta do it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.